Hey lovelies, good day and welcome back to my channel. Please, if you're joining us for the first time, don't forget to click the subscription button and subscribe to my channel, okay? And to my returning subscribers, thank you so much for sticking here with me. Please, subscribe to my channel, it costs you absolutely nothing, just a little way of you supporting us and helping us to grow, okay? It doesn't take anything from just click that subscription button and that is it. It's as simple as ABC. So, um... Uh, is this uh, video training online uh, about a housewife that uh, killed her house help and not just cleaned her, um, threw her away, threw her over the fence rather. So, and she was let her cost anyway. So, I'm trying to speak out, okay? This is a letter to all housewives all over the whole world, okay? Please. I'm pleading, okay. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to tell you what you're going to do in your own house. I'm not going to say how to run people that are around you. So, but there's one thing I want to make clear to you all is that um, there is no gain in being wicked. You don't get anything. You don't lose weight. You don't add in your height. You don't add money in your account. Being wicked. This world is so short. This life is so so short that being wicked can get you little. Can get you absolutely nothing can really get into troubles okay you went and brought someone's child to live with you and you're maltreating the person same thing that you cannot do to your own biological kids that's what you're doing to another man's child okay the same way you pushed out your baby or had an oppression the same painful pregnancy experience that you had but your own precious kid that's the same thing that that woman's that house have lived with you that's the same thing that the mother had to win, pass through before bringing her to this world so if you know you are not capable financially um you see someone for this house help they be hawking on the road hawking such as water you can bring somebody from the village or any of um, your trained person in school but the person will now work and work and over level you yourself except you cannot do to your own kids okay yeah i can remember that back then in school one girl that was living somewhere once it's 12 pm she's off meanwhile school closes by three that's school goes by 1 30 and we have lesson till three once it's 12, she leaves the school premises. Why? Because her madam, she must go and take care of her madam kids and all that. So what am I saying? <laughs> there is no reward in being wicked. This life is too short for you to be wicked to your house help. Okay? If you know you're not financially capable to bring in one, please leave them to suffer with their parents in peace. Oh, it's better. They're bringing someone's baby in and you're killing the person and you're being wicked. Okay, some of them in your house will not even rest. They go from cooking to cleaning to washing to take care of your kids. So, if like, oh my god, the workload is too much. Me, as an adult, there are some days I wake up and I don't feel like doing anything. Yeah, it's normal. So, now that same way that I feel, I know that someone that stays with me sometimes he or she might be tired, don't want to work, and all that. So, why would I make it mandatory? You people overwork them. A child of 10 years, 12 years, within what's it? So are you at your own late thirties and forties, you cannot even do it. So how do you think a baby will now do what you cannot do? You get. I always use my my friend's aunt as an example. The girl that she was staying then, her children they call her sister. First of all, she trained this girl in school. You know the good part. The girl is now married. Married to a very wealthy guy. You so as if she just married and managed him very well and on her wedding day come and see that auntie that's what she the girl in question called that her auntie mommy because you know why she did things that her own biological mom could not even do to her come and see the girl like that auntie was like come and see fine clothes baby girl speaks good English she's because she's educated and above that she was still blessed with a good husband that has cash okay so nobody knows tomorrow in my match that person what that person leaves all your doors of blessing just close yes so some of them have good luck and that is why because of your wickedness once you're away they'll start maltreating your kids they'll start putting their angers on them because they have been curious they have been so wicked and been you have been so mean to them so they do what they try and maltreat your own kids so they'll get a test of what you have been doing to them so please close your eyes Imagine someone is doing that same thing to your husband, house help to your precious child. Did you open your eyes now? Did you smile? I think you need to change. Okay, yeah. Okay, so please, I'm begging you. The same way you want another person to treat your own child, please treat your house help like that. 
okay you don't bring a child and start ah, it is called child abuse now yes now how about it's too much it's too much some people once you see the house you know ah, this is house this is madame children you know why they wear stupid drag clothes they will buy them gown like this the gown will be flowing like this they want you to wear that gown for 25 years you wear one cloth for all your life but their kids each time you have a new garden they must buy new clothes for them so are you now we get to your house help and your kids okay you know they looking good is good but not good for someone that is taking care of that your precious children ah that's very wrong that's bad at the end we all account for whatever we've done on this planet earth it doesn't even end here okay so stop stop the abuse is too much the abuse is too too much People that are taking care of the house help these days are so few and why? For what? That is very, very wrong. That is very, very bad. You might not try to be your own child. Maybe once you start taking that child as your own child, I think you will improve. Okay? Yeah, so we'll say, uh, I'm not working. It's only husband, my hobby that brings money. Therefore, uh, there is no money to take care of the house. Oh, yeah, carry the girl, take her back to where you, you brought her from. Since you know you don't, you are not capable of taking care of the child. So there is no need for you to keep someone that you cannot take care of in your own house. Your kids fall sick, you take them to the good hospital. You ask them fall sick, tell them to manage. And on top of the management, they'll still be working. That's very, very wrong. You guys can do better, please. If you know you cannot take care of a house, of course, you are not financially stable, you're not emotionally, you're not mentally stable. Please, please, I'm begging you. Kukuma leave the house help in her parents' house. Leave him in her parents' house. It's better for them so that at least they'll be helpful and see her hair. This is it. Not bringing someone's child and trying to uh, uh, frustrate them. Hobby gets you angry, you unleash your anger on the house help. Wife gets you angry, you unleash your anger on the house help. Don't be so. Things are not done that way. Okay? You can improve. Give them some rest. Sometimes, okay, like this day I went out with my girlfriend. Um, and two were sitting. house help would just be sitting down, facing the wall. Auntie and uncle and the kids were sitting around the table, eating. House help not drink water, not to were just sitting down. And that kind of house help we say, if they give her 500 naira to put poison in your post food, she will do it because 500 naira she has not seen it all her life. So, because you've not given her that privilege, she will gladly do it. Think if I naira is a very big money. I don't know if you get what I'm saying. Even if you don't get, try and get it because I speak clearly and I know you understand what I'm saying. Okay? So, that is it. The people that you don't need to play with in this life, you see your house help, you see your driver, you see your gatekeeper, you see those people. They are the easiest way to get to you because your help knows you in and out. She knows the time you come back from work, he knows where you're working, he knows where your kids are, he knows you get. So, why would you now be maltreating her? Because you think she has nowhere to fall back to. And once you beat her, she runs away, she still come back because she doesn't have anywhere to go to. One day she run and she will not come back. One day, one man will just promise her 1,000 naira. Piam! She disappeared. That time you'll be arrested. And the child you not even see her because you don't even know where she is. You get due to hunger, she have left your home because of small money that you can actually avoid it. You see some house they will go into school by 10 o'clock in the morning, no food, nothing with empty stomach. You still expect them to do well in academics. You still be saying, Ah, this my house help it doesn't know anything, it block head and all that. But you do not allow the house to study. Herself will work from morning to 12 midnight and still wake up again in the morning. Work again, you madam, you'll be sleeping. You know, it's the only sleep that you came to this life to sleep. You will not assist your house. Some of you will not come in your house, you not sleep with your husband. Why won't she sleep with your husband? Why you be, when is your house they do the cooking? Your house help cleans the house, your house wash the clothes. Your husband will definitely be attracted to your house. And you know why she's doing all this work? She's still maintaining her shape, she still be sexy and fit. And you, madam, you'll be eating anyhow, you'll be sleeping, you'll be getting fat before you know it. Your husband, your husband will eat you as the madam and face your house. Help. You get yes, so and because your house is she will generally go to her girl's bed. Nursing herself don't enter to second wife. Herself don't turn side chick, they find side chick up and down. You know that side chick you're looking for is your house help that is in your heart because of what you have been so rude, wicked, and mean to her. <sighs> so please, we can improve. We can do better. So at this earth, we'll be habitat for all of us. This world, this life is too short to be to be cruel to someone. It's too short for you to be wicked to someone. It's too short for you to maltreat someone else's child. So for you to do the same thing, you cannot do your own baby to another person's child. Please, you can always try better. You can always improve. And if you have already done something wrong to your house, you can always apologize. Why have, have all those things that make her to become gullible? 
you get to so shower my ice cream, meat pie, pizza, let her have a test of it. This is why, shout out to my girlfriend, Favor. Yes, I must say this right now. If you see the girl that she stays with, you will not differentiate that from her. You will not differentiate the girl from her kids. You get lost up to one year, she speaks good English. More than... Sometimes when I come to her, I just want to speak to her, I like, say, please, I don't have strength for your wahala. This, you know that the house has, I tell you, the private, she's in secondary school now, she, my, her auntie, that's my girlfriend, Favor. I'm super proud of her in that aspect. Put her in a very good school, school bus comes to pick and drop her every day by 4 p.m. If you see her house, always sharp, always fine, fine hair, fine clothes, she's always neat. That kind of house help cannot betray you. And God forbid, even if devil enter inside her, she will not betray you. Because you have shown her life. You have yeah. you guys need to see her the girl. Like if you see her, you know that she has her own beautiful soap, her own fine cream. She applies roll on since she's now in secondary school. She combs her hair, she braids hair, she wears neat queenie from fine shoes, she has lunch, but you get can be nice. This kind of thing, being nice in this life is very simple. You can be nice. Favor, I give you to I give you that. Okay, you're very good at in that aspect. You know, when our children is tries to stop when they have said she beat such kids and caution them. But they call they get so like please there is always room for improvement. Improve because being wicked does not pay. Okay, that woman that killed someone's child, she to shoot, they will kill her. Yeah, so she'll be locked up for life. Even if she does not go to jail, she'll die by hanging. Because that's murder. And murder, that's a horrible offense. So guys, please, thank you. And um, if you find my words so offensive, sorry, but this is the only way I can pour out my mind. I've been having a lot of things to say. Okay, that one actually got to me. That killing of a house help actually got to me. Okay, so I really had to spill the tea, all right? So please subscribe to my channel mm -hmm. you heard me subscribe oh, subscribe it costs you absolutely nothing just help us grow if you can like comment share okay and um, subscribe please and um, till next time thank you for tuning in all right and thank you bye